More than 200 million people follow Rihanna across social media, so when she speaks, a lot of people listen. She sent Snapchat shares plunging, the stock losing nearly $600 million after calling out an ad that she says lets down domestic victims of domestic violence. This morning, pop sensation Rihanna is slamming Snapchat after an ad posted on the social media app by the mobile game Would You Rather asked users if they'd rather slap Rihanna or punch Chris Brown. Rihanna, Rihanna outraged, posting on Instagram, I'm just trying to figure out what the point was with this mess. I'd love to call it ignorance, but I know you ain't that dumb. You spent money to animate something that would intentionally bring shame to domestic violence victims and made a joke of it. Yes, ma'am. 2009, a judge sentenced Rihanna's then boyfriend, Chris Brown, to five years probation after the singer pleaded guilty to felony assault for beating Rihanna after a pre Grammy party. Chris in the corner. Brown's attorney responding to the ad that appeared on Snapchat, telling today the stock market has given Snapchat a kick to the groin. In a statement, Snapchat telling today, this advertisement is disgusting and never should have appeared on our service. We are so sorry we made the terrible mistake of allowing it through our review process. We are investigating how that happened so that we can make sure it never happens again. Many of Rihanna's fans weighing in on Twitter, one saying Rihanna may single-handedly destroy Snapchat. Another adding, my wife said I gotta delete Snapchat. Even Chelsea Clinton tweeting, just awful. Awful that anyone thinks this is funny. Awful that anyone thinks this is appropriate. Awful that any company would approve this. The camera serves as a homepage. It hasn't been an easy year so far for Snapchat after it issued a widely panned update that changed its interface. Reality TV star Kylie Jenner said last month she doesn't open the app anymore. The ticker sinking 8% today. Thank you, Kylie Jenner. Shares sank 6.1%, wiping out $1.3 billion in market value. We love you, as for Rihanna, she appears to be telling her fans to get rid of Snapchat too. This isn't about my personal feelings because I don't have much of them, she says. But all the women, children and men that have been victims of domestic violence in the past, and especially the ones who haven't made it out yet, you let us down. Shame on you. Throw the whole apology away. We reached out to the maker of the app, Would You Rather, but have not heard back. Our parent company, NBC Universal, is an investor in Snapchat. Craig and Savannah. All right, Joe, thank you. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.